Hornbill Festival to Tate One Brush Ruguna, a G sixty even the Kushiginase. Amikan Ekpar Salido, Itu Salbi, domestic tourists will be no libi tourists from outside the country. Pishi Aigina, Amantiko Parese, Nagalin News Network Braji, domestic tourists can will be no libi tourists from outside the country. Tangi, Tahan Itata, Tahan Laga experience in that Juliase, or Tahan B, Itu Hornbill Festival de Aigina. Ki Nutun learn Grace, no libi, ki Nutun experience grow, Parese, Amican, Tahanaga, Pabna, Jagan, Hutibo, Ibi, Amican, Tahanaga, Pabna, Arotahan, Kikwe, Amican Hunilobo. I'm Tini. And you are from? I'm from Germany. Germany. Yeah. So, is this your first time visiting here in Nagaland? Yes, it is. So, how is your experience so far? Uh, I enjoy a lot. Uh, I really enjoy the culture. It's very different, but um, it's a good experience, and the people are very nice. Uh, Everybody is very humble. I enjoy a lot, yeah. So what made you uh, decide to come and visit the Hornbill Festival this year? So I've heard a lot about it. I stayed in Guwahati for some time and I traveled a bit. And many people have told me about it. Many people went here also. And then I've met some friends who uh, brought me here and who asked me to volunteer here. And yeah, that's why I came. And then, uh, have you tried the uh, local foods out here? Uh, not really because I'm veg. So <laughs> there's not much choice for me, but still, um, yeah. Yeah, so, like, uh, what story are you going to take back home after this festival? Oh, um, definitely the diversity of culture, um, the good music. It's different than the music that I listen to normally, but I can dance quite well to it. <laughs> and then I will also take some, maybe some handcrafted items for my family. I'm from Spain, from Madrid. So, is this your first time visiting the Hornbill Festival? Uh, yes. So you are here alone or with your team? I'm alone. I'm alone. Yeah. So what made you visit the festival this year? Uh, I don't know. I was in I was in Bangladesh and I heard that it was it was pretty good, very very fun. So here I am. Okay. Yeah. So do you have plans to stay till the last day or when are you going back? No, probably not. I've already been here since the second, so I'll probably go tomorrow. Yeah. So how is your experience so far in this festival? It's good. It's very entertaining. I like how how varied it is. Like during the day, you have like cultural activities and stuff, so it's it's fun. And then during at night, you have music and all that stuff, so it's also fun. And also, have you tried the local dish here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've tried. So, I've tried to try everything, and I really like it. So, well, which dish is your favorite? I don't know. It's it's hard to choose. I I, I like I like everything. I like especially those dishes that we don't have back home like dog and stuff it, it's fun to just try you know yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so what is that one story that you would like to take back home yeah yeah from definitely home. all my friends are gonna be jealous yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we are from Bangalore we are exploring Northeast and uh, we always wanted to attend the Hornbill festival and this time we got that opportunity to attend yeah so, so how are you liking it so far it's been really vibrant, something uh, totally different than what we have seen in the rest of the India. It's a, it's a beautiful experience altogether. Yeah. How is your experience as well, man? It's good. We got to see different cultural uh, dances, different uh, tribal dances. And uh, we also visited a few museums. So today we were able to understand why and how they're doing it and what we are watching. So what is that one thing... Uh, if you would like to take it back with you at home from here uh, from Hornbill festival I think it's the rich heritage that Naga people carry so that's something that I'm going to take home there's uh, many memories with that attached with that How about you? Uh, well uh, with that it's the union when everybody is together enjoying the festival and uh, the, the festive vibes here it's totally different than what we see in different parts so if given an opportunity, would you like to visit the Hornbill Festival again in the coming years? Definitely, we would. We would. Yeah. I'm Alex from Switzerland. Switzerland. Yes. So is this your first time visiting the Hornbill Festival? This is the first time visiting the Hornbill Festival and I'm very happy to be here. So how are you liking it so far? I love it. And for me, there's a lot of uh, interesting experiences and fascinating experiences, which are not just, I mean, the dances, the performances is one thing. But all the little encounters here and there, the openness of the people, it's something very beautiful. So many times I see myself uh, just observing and being, being fascinated by what is, what is happening. So have you also uh, tried uh, having this uh, local dish, the local foods out here? 
Uh, yes, I had some. I don't remember the names. I had some delicious chicken yesterday that was marinated with lemongrass. Oh, I had the... Today I had the eel, smoked eel, dried. It's very nice. Mm. And then uh, what made you... Uh, what made you decide to visit the Hornbill Festival this year? Um, I'm interested in tribal culture and yeah I was hoping to to see here get a bit a feel a feel of it I'm also very curious of how it is lived here in a it is a very special environment right where it's somehow a show but somehow there's people are also it's sharing but it's I mean there's also not there's not so much teaching in the sense of people don't it's all about sharing dances and food. I feel there's there's a lot more to share, and but this somehow happens happens in between. It's very interesting, but this was my motivation. Yes. And, uh, how did you actually discover our state, Nagaland? A friend uh, a friend told me I was in Odisha, and he said, "Oh, there's this festival happening right now," and I felt like, "Okay, I have to go." And then I came. Yeah, one last question. Uh, what is that one story or experience that you would like to take back home with you from here? Oh, okay. So, one very beautiful experience was at the at the campsite where there there were all the tents. People were, I mean, everybody has their tent, but then people were, were sitting around the fire and. I was instantly invited to join and there was this beautiful atmosphere, beautiful circle. We played some music together. So it was, um, I, f I feel, I felt a very s strong sense of, uh, oh, there's, we have here a community, come join this community. We, we, are, we are now together in this. And that I, I find a very beautiful feeling that uh, I felt, felt particularly strongly here in Nagaland at this festival. So happy to be here. Thank you. So that was the reactions and opinions from the tourists who came uh, here in Nagaland to visit Hornbill Festival from different parts of the world. I can without you Jadam the Jani Paishiki Dakan itu Nagaland the Ahiado or especially the Hornbill Festival the to part Luado. Takan ikta kushipa to ki as you do, Amikan Laga Naga culture, our diversity to Kushipa Laga Jani Pashe, our Duklano, Amikan Laga richness in culture, our traditions, our Amikan Laga unity, itu tan Pishu Kushipa, she wanted to make a Janai Tisha, Amikan Itunishna news, our Koporkan update Kota was side, keeping Nagalan news network for more news update. This is Komidonongti with video journalist Aimba Shamir for Nagalan Nisabo.